Did you know that SmartSuite has over 40 different field types to choose from? Hi, I'm Dan Lehman from Automation Helpers, a SmartSuite implementation partner. You can explore all of the field types that SmartSuite has to offer. When you click to add a new field, you can explore all field types and take a look to browse all of the different options that you have. I'm gonna take you through a few of my favorite field types. First off, we have the compound fields. Instead of adding first name and last name each time, you can actually have a first and a last name, add a middle name or a title, and so it's almost like multiple fields in one. Next up, we have the address field. I can click on it and just start entering an address. This is gonna validate it with Google Maps, and we can actually display all of our addresses on a map in a nice visualization. Next up, we have linked records. This is pretty much gonna give you database superpowers. So we can link to different records that we have. And from here, once we link a record, then we have the ability to have lookups. Lookups are like a little view into our linked record. So in this case, we're pulling the name from our related record to be able to display here. We also have counts, which can count up our number of linked records, and they actually can drill through. So we can click on it and see the underlying records and that'll take us to those records themselves. From here, we have a roll-up. And so a roll-up is able to pull information from the linked records and kind of suck them up and do some kind of calculation on them. So if we take a look here, we've got a roll-up and we're pulling this from the currency and we're adding it together. This is perfect if you want to add up the value of outstanding opportunities that you have. And from here, we have formulas. We've got lots of different options to be able to create calculations. We've got a basic editor that we can use here, or we can toggle this and we've got an advanced editor where we have lots of different operators and functions to be able to make calculations of our own. We have lots that we can do with documents and files. I've got a digital signature, so I can click and I can actually capture a signature here if I want on a form. We have files and images. If I click here, I can add files that are local on my computer, or I can connect to a number of different cloud services. And we also have SmartSuite's innovative Smart Docs feature. So if I click in here, I've got a full editor that I can use for capturing notes. I've got my WYSIWYG editor, but I can also insert items like a checklist here and be able to take notes here for us to be able to share and collaborate. Or I could call out someone from my team so that they could actually see these notes and get a notification about this. Maybe I wanna reference another record inside of the system. So there's lots of powerful capabilities within SmartDocs. SmartSuite has powerful project management capabilities. With the assigned to field, our status and due date, we're able to assign out tasks to people on our team. Then we're able to see those items in our My Work area, which unifies across all of our different apps that we have inside of our workspace so that we can see items that have been assigned to us here. We also have a percent complete field to show an indicator of where we're at. We've got a checklist field, which gives us the ability to essentially have subtasks here and assign these out to people. And we have a robust time tracking log so that we can add an amount of time have multiple people on our team add time to it to be able to track against tasks and projects that we have. You don't have to take my word for it for how powerful these fields are. Give them a try on your next project by signing up for SmartSuite.